Hello, this is Chris Menard. Let me show you how to create a Word document that has different page numbering. So as an example, this is my cover page and it's page number one of one. So let me get down here to the bottom. Go to the Layout tab, click the word Breaks. I want to put in my table of contents. That's going to be a section break next page. So now I have page two of two. I'm going to put in TOC. Control enter because my table of contents is going to end up being on two pages. And I'm going to go ahead and just center that. You don't have to. So here we go. We have three pages total, real quick. Cover page, and then I did a section break. Next page. Table of contents, and then I did a page break. Table of contents, page two and page four needs to be an empty page. The reason is if you grab a book from your bookshelf or just wherever and look through it, pages one, three, five, seven, all the odd pages are on the right and all the even pages are on the left. So page four needs to be a blank page. So breaks, next page, section break. This is gonna be a blank page and look, I'm actually going to type the word blank just to keep up with this. Breaks. Section break next page. Page 5 of 5. And I'm going to go back to left align. And this is where your document actually is. Meaning, this is, what, this is the hard part. And look, I put in, there's my document. So here we go. Control home. I have a 10 page document. Here's my cover page. I don't want a page, I don't want any page numbering on it because it's the cover page. I'm going to go to page number two, table of contents. I'm going to double click in the header area right up here. If you don't like that, you can also go to insert, header the long way, but just double click up here. Notice it says header section two, but over here it says same as previous. Turn off link to previous, page number, format. I want these to be Roman numerals. It's my table of contents and I'm going to start it at number one. And then the question is where do you want the page numbers? I'm going to just put them in the, I'm going to put them in the middle so you can see them. There's Roman numeral one for the first table of contents page. Roman numeral two for table of contents page two. Here's my blank page. Notice it says same as previous. Turn off the link. Delete it. Let's just, I'm going to just go back up top to make sure that's still there. Perfect. Perfect. Should be nothing on the cover, so everything's still good. Go down to the next header. Click in it. Same as, turn off the link, because this is where the document actually starts page number, format again, there you go, one, two, three, start at page one, page number, top of page, one, two, perfect. To get out of the header and footer, just double click in your document. Let's go look at it real quick. Cover page, no page. Page two, which is the first table of contents page, Roman numeral one. Page three, Roman numeral two. Page four should have nothing, and it doesn't. I can get rid of the word blank. I'm not going to, but you know what I'm saying. And page number five right here is page one, page two. So hopefully that's how you take care of doing a document with multiple page numbering and Roman numerals.